Mosquito numbers are still up despite continued spraying by Cass County Vector Control. One of the hot spots is in the Concordia area in Moorhead, and the city is now asking for help from neighbors. Valley News Team's Katie Opperly takes a look at the overall numbers in the metro and what you can do. It's been a constant battle for mosquito managers with aerial and ground spraying. One area in particular has crews scratching their heads. On the campus of Concordia was the highest trap in the bi-county area that we've been monitoring uh, as of this last Friday. Ben Prather says mosquito counts in this area have more than doubled compared to years past from about 200 or 300 to more than 700 recently. Anywhere within a mile of that trap, we're kind of thinking there's going to be something that's big that we just can't see through, through the vegetation. We can't see on our aerial photography. We can't see with our LIDAR imagery. Prather's budget stands at the $1.5 million mark, and he expects to top that this year. The expenditures this year are gonna gonna exceed very likely any time in our past history in terms of the amount that we we're spraying. You know, we're sitting here uh, on the 5th of August and uh, we've already applied more product than we did all of last year. So now they're calling on you to do your part. They aren't asking for any additional money just to check your property. Keep in mind, if you have a low lying pond that Vector Control isn't aware of, they want to know about it and are willing to treat. Vector Control also wants you to check your gutters, drains and sump pumps, hoping that if the standing water goes away, so will the mosquitoes. In Moorhead, Katie Offerly, Valley News Live. To check if Vector Control already knows about the water near your home, you can check out a link we have on our website, valleynewslive.com.